This will be an in-swinger with the right foot. Right toward the post and a goal. She just turned it inside. Izzy Newton, goal 38 here on the season, and it is a huge one. Also, oh, Izzy Newton is very familiar <laughs> to Jefferson Academy. She scored against J.A. there. Onside, look out. Steger coming out with a slide kick. He's got to get back. This one will be on the ground. Well played by the defenders there as Kate Henry had gotten loose. And this one off the crossbar again. Oh, wow. And a drive and a goal. All kinds of stuff going on. Izzy Newton got pulled down by Steger. Oh, bounding ball throw. Look out. Izzy Newton's got a little bit of speed here. She's going to win the race. Keeps possession. Works her way through. Got tripped up. And we may have ourselves a penalty kick here. We do indeed. The official runs to the spot. Newton just kept working her way through the two defenders. And it will be Newton that will take the penalty kick opportunity. So Stegner's going to have to stay on her line. She cannot go until the ball is struck. She can move laterally, but she can't jump forward until the ball is actually struck. Now, keepers cheat all the time and take a big jump forward right before the ball is struck. Try to cut the angle a little bit, but you got to guess right. Which way is Newton going to go? Right-footed kicker. And the ball will be live as soon as she strikes it. This is not like a shootout. If that ball is defended by Stegner... It is still a live ball. Stegner going to try to make herself as big as possible. Newton still standing. The official making sure everybody's outside the 18 here. All right. Newton will settle back. Four steps. Here we go. Drives it inside. The near side post. Stegner guessed that she was going to go far. And it's 3-0, and it's two goals for Izzy Newton. Tips it ahead. Here come the Sun Devils. 30 seconds left. Romo Nichols will earn a corner here for Kent Denver. Man, oh, man. They don't even necessarily have to take this. She's going to send it in. And Kent Denver can celebrate here. Back-to-back -back state championships for the Sun Devils. This time in emphatic fashion. 3-0, all three goals coming in the first half. Izzy Newton in the 8th, Maria Romo Nichols in the 11th, and then a penalty kick by Newton in the 36th minute made it 3-0. And Jefferson Academy shut out here in this state championship. Congratulations to Claire Welch, the keeper for Kent Denver. That's back-to-back -back clean sheets in the state championship game. 7th title in Kent Denver history for girls soccer. They finish 18 and 1.